Welcome to another episode of my channel and today is also a very special day because we are going to bring you to one of the most historical sites here in Lisbon. It is located in the heart of Lisbon and what I am talking to you is exactly the castle which is behind me. Uh, today I'm going with my classmates, with my professor, we are going to go on that castle. So. If you want to go here in Lisbon, don't miss to visit one of the most important sites, one of the most landmarks that you shouldn't miss to visit when you come here in Lisbon. Castle of São George is located in the highest hill in Lisbon city. As far as we know that Lisbon is known as the city of seven hills. So currently we are here in Marti Muniz and Marti Muniz is one of the busiest place here in Lisbon and usually you can find here most of the Asian people from India, Bangladesh and the Chinese as well. So for those who have not yet subscribed on our channel, please don't forget to subscribe. See you later guys! Climbing now, right here in a very hilly street, going to Castle Sao George, and my classmates are at the back. So it's a good exercise for us. As you can see, how elevated the road is. Yeah, it's totally elevated area, and we are passing here in the hospital of. I don't know what is the name of this hospital. The Castillo de São George is one of the Lisbon's most distinctive monuments being situated on the city's highest hill. 
The oldest known fortification at this spot dates from the 2nd century BC, although some of the remains found here date from as far back as the 6th century BC. Archaeological evidence has also made it possible to discover traces of the presence of Phoenicians, Greeks, Carthaginians, Romans, and Muslims, confirming the human occupation of this area since very remote times. The castle itself was founded in the 10th and 11th centuries when Lisbon was an important Moorish port. In 1147, the first king of Portugal, Dom Alfonso Enriquez, captured both the castle and the city from the Moors. The castle enjoyed its most important period between the 13th and 14th centuries. It was also here in the 16th century that the king Dom Manuel received Vasco da Gama after his sea voyage to India and that the first Portuguese theatre play, written by Gil Vicente, was performed to mark the birth of the kingdom João III. Declared a national monument in 1910, the castle underwent major restoration work in the 20th century, which left it with its present-day appearance. It is one of the most important places in the city and a very popular leisure space among the people living in the neighboring area. It is generally agreed to afford the best view over the city and the river Tagus. The Castillo de São George is dedicated to St. George, the patron saint of England. This unexpected patronage is due to King Alfonso Enriquez presenting the castle to his English wife, Philippa of Lancaster, as a wedding gift in 1387. A statue of St. George can be seen in the castle walls near to the Arco do Castillo. It is located in Alfama and opened from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. during March to October and 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. during November to February. The ticket cost for adult is 10 euro, for children under 10 are free and students are 5 euro. So guys, we are actually here on the top of the Castle George. As you can see the view, it's so nice, it's so beautiful. Oh, I will take your hand and we'll rise up from the dust. Currently we are here in South George Castle and uh, with my classmates and uh, here is one of my beautiful classmates hi. and uh, say hi to my vlog hi. and uh, we are here to visit this very historical site right? Yes. She's from Nepal by the way and uh, her good name is? I'm sorry. Sandia. Sandia Karki. Yes. Yeah tell me something about the trip for today. Today I'm enjoying the historical place in Portugal. Okay. Actually, I'm very interested to uh, look like this because I will, I mean, I've been in ten years in journalism in Kathmandu. Wow. And then I'll write and this is the know. things in, the, in my magazine. In the, you can search in my name is Google my folder. Okay, I will, I will. And then uh, very interesting to try meeting this guy. Yeah, meeting. yeah. Uh, it's a memorable day in Chile. Guys, he is from Nepal and you have to visit Nepal as you know that Mount Everest is there. Yes. <laughs> she is one of my beautiful classmates in Portuguese language. Can you say, some, can you say something about our film trip today? Uh, we're in a castle. Okay. And um, we're having fun. What do you think why it is important for us to visit the, one of the historical sites here in Lisbon? I guess. Do you know some history about it? <laughs> but how do you find it? That's nice. why we are here. It's beautiful. It's really beautiful. Your first been, time to come here? No, I have been here for like several uh, times. Yes. Okay. I don't know. Okay, tell your name. Hi, Mazel. Okay. <laughs>
meet our beautiful and energetic professora, Miss Barbara, in our class in Portuguese language. Say hi, professora, to my Hello. viewers. Hello. Okay. <laughs> I just want to ask, what is this? Castelo Sao George, right? Castelo Sao George. Castelo Sao George. Yeah. Yes. Is this a, a very important uh, site in Lisbon? Or yes, it's true. The, it's most, the most important site in Lisbon. Okay, and we who is Sao George? Sao George yeah. was a saint. Okay. Uh, Santo Padroeiro okay. in Portuguese and okay. the defensor of Portugal. Ah, so okay, so he's like a hero. He's like a it's hero. A prince he also? was like a hero, see. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Professor, why it's important for us to visit such a place like this? For and to know and share our culture. Yes. Uh, not only the language, but the yes. culture. Especially us, like the emigrants, right? Of course. So we need to know, yeah. And you like it? You enjoy it? We really <laughs> like it, Professor. I hope we have to come here again. And we can visit another site as well we can in the future. Try, yes. <laughs> and uh, I'm feeling sad right now because we are already like two weeks or three weeks right now in the class. I think uh, yeah. more three weeks. And I don't yeah. want to end the class. Yeah. I want to continue That's it. Good. <laughs> we can do the next, uh, the next, class. next level. Yeah. yeah. Next level. yeah. If yeah. you want to continue, of course, I'll stay we can request. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyway, guys, that would be all for today. <laughs> and uh, as I said, this is our beautiful professora. <laughs> so see you next time. Bye. 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 <laughs> Do you guys enjoy? Yeah. Do you guys enjoy the trip? What can you say about our trip for today? It was awesome. Yeah. And you guys are all Fun. Okay. Uh, do you think it's gonna be like a worth remembering tree? Yes, of course. Okay. For sure. <laughs> and we'll keep in touch always, even yes. we are no longer in the class, right? Mm -hmm. For okay. sure. Okay. And you should add me on Instagram too. Sure. <laughs> and you have to subscribe in my channel. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <subscribe>. Say hi. <laughs>up a very memorable trip for today and it was fun you know getting to know each other and uh, merging yourself with different nationalities is such a very nice feeling learning to adopt a new cultures and traditions and that is an awesome experience and I hope that this would not be the last uh, field trip that we are going to have I hope that the next time also and even like uh, I don't want to end this class I mean, if I have to choose, I want to continue because, you know, learning is a continuous process. So, yeah, we really enjoyed and have a fun today, especially that the weather for today is uh, very cool and it's something like cloudy, but it's, it's fine. Some of my classmates appear in my video, as you can see, and of course, our very beautiful and energetic professor. I am very much thankful to them. I appreciate their support and at first I am hesitant but they are very respectful and very supportive. I am so much thankful and uh, I would love to share with you all the experience that I have uh, here in Portugal, this beautiful country, this beautiful culture. So hope you guys don't forget to subscribe on my channel if you have not yet. Thank you so much for all our colleagues today who appear in our video and support us and uh, above all the professor I also thank you. Uh, Thomas, thank you so much. Uh, Senora. Uh, muito obrigado, senhora Barbara. Barbara. Muito okay. obrigado. And uh, bye guys. Depois. See you next time on my video. Até logo. Até próxima.